Neil Mortis and uh, on the Gishan, I mean D of course F U I mean on the Kimi doon sa may baba yep. and on the red side happy feet emperors MB sa kanyang Granger Tan on the Lunox Mr. V sa kanyang Minotaur Arbe on the Thames and Tram sa kanyang Brock and as I mentioned no, yung uh, Liam Rito alam ni Yaku na hindi siya pwedeng uh, hindi pwedeng ganun yung playstyle niya so he opted to go for the Bounty Hunter now yung ganitong klaseng Liam Mortis pwede, pwede na siyang sumama kasi kahit makuha niya yung resource ng mga kampi niya wala naman siyang pakailan kasi if, if they get the kill and yeah. mapunta pa yun kay uh, Liam Mort ang laking value nun kasi yung gold na mawawala sa kanyang team na pupunta naman sa kanya yeah. wow this is gonna be a hurry look at the damage niya may heart from Kami pero may tutulog sa sabi sa matang gilid sa so, retribution si Epi ang makakuha ng crab coin dun sa top I think dun sa my bottom lane still also happy pita yung first to get the crab coin so yep. it's a lot of value that you'll get out of the early rotations mula sa Happy Feet Emperors. Yeah, pero malaking problema to ah, for Signal Ultra Wars, yung thumbs ng Happy Feet Emperors. Uh, medyo may iwan. Ito yung sinasabi natin may iwan sa kusina. Kasi Signal Ultra Wars, may time lang na pwede na sila lumaban. Yes, yung unang power strike boys yung level 4 ni uh, Goshen, pwedeng pwede mo i-capitalize yun as you have the Minotaur and the Kai. Pero, hi hihintay nila yung cooldown nun every single time. So, yung Happy Feet Emperors, may window talaga na makakapag-farm sila ng kaya pa. Uh, interestingly, this area is already up here, the top lane with the level 4. Sa patala sa baba. Na, ito rin si Tan. Billions activated already. It's very early on. I think that they're wasting their time. This is my bottom lane. Yep. Season will just port away as well as few. Aalis na sila dito. They know that they've already they are already able to clear out the wave. They might just surrender your turtle dito. But at the very least, Signal Ultra Warriors are getting a lot better farm kumpara dito sa Happy yeah, sure. Emperors. Again, they understand the idea na wag na wag mo bibigyan ng kahit ano yung uh, Lunox. And Happy Feet Emperors, first rotation ni uh, Tan dito, wasted kagad. Nag-recall lang Signal Ultra Wars. And mukhang isusurrender nila, pero hindi. Kukontest nila kasi alam nila wala yung, uh, wala yung Franco dito sa may uh, turtle area. Oh, I like uh, what Arbe is doing. Just putting out the sights already. At the Ooh, ang ganda ng barrier. Gandong. Napakagad na prayer turn take mula Signal. Sobrang swapi kasi they waited for the timing where you Lunox kasi magsasawa na. Hindi naman pwede nakatambay lang forever yeah, yeah, yeah. yung Lunox eh. Sure. So for sure, at a certain point, kukuha siya ng mga, ng mga buffs. And Signal towards are more than ready. They also have the Mage Killer KF. So no matter what happens, napakabilis ng pag-take nila ng Turtle. So, I don't really like what Franco did there kasi alam alam mo gano'ng kakritikal yung level 4 niya. The moment na nakita ng Signal Ultra Wars na nasa nasa pa si Mr. B dito, sabi niya, sige, tara, turtle tayo, hindi kaya i-contest ng Habib Tempress. So, even though may lunok sa kabila, kapag nag-contest naman, once na matapos na yung Order of Brilliance or yung Order of Chaos, wala nang bato yung Habib Tempress. And another invade mo na Signal Ultra Wires. This time, para sa buff, Desanya gets it. Or, actually, I don't know if Desanya or if you... It might be Sa you, pero... Actually, dalawa sila. Dalawa sila may buffer. So, yeah. either or. Pero yung crab, mapupunta sa side oh. dito ng Happy Feet Emperors. Well, fish out where Arbe is. Nakita na nga nila dito. They will jump in with this Anya. Is it gonna be oh, a no problem? Blood. Combo. Suwabe. Suwabe, suwabe. Alam niya kasi na yun na may turtle buff siya. So, alam niya na malakas yung kanya damage. Sobrang ano? Sobrang pogi niya doon. Kasi pag nagkamali siya doon, remember na si Lance yung turret. And kapag nagamit ni Thames yung ultimate niya, hindi hindi siya mapapatay doon. At baka mapapatay pa niya sa Lisa niya. Pero oh. yako na may na lane! Oh my Ooh. god, it's a nice hook from Mr. B. And nililis pa siya ni hook. Beautiful hook mula doon kay Arbe. Kan kanina din eh, hinintay ni Lisa na lumagpas at almost turn range na bago siya tumalon. Yeah. Para this must save siya. More than enough, and now they will push the mid lane. I think wala sila kanina ngayon. Meron na meron sila because of the mage killer emblem. Wala kay Fuel. Oh. Pero Fuel kinapit na kanila dito. The damage si Krak goes down. Pero pag ganda ang ipit doon, wala kay SON Esports. They'll get the Lunox as well. At walang magawa si Arbe. Kundi tumakbo sa may bandang top. Yako activating yung kanyang ultimate para mapag-depensa. And will be able to do so. Signal Ultra Warriors. Totally different mula sa previous game. Yep. Again, alam nila na yung power spike na meron sila is yung level 4 negotiation. At the same time, yung early game tower taking nila. So, Signal Ultra Wars, they understand their timings, yung clear conditions. Tower take, and yung level 4, pag nagsabay, walang problema. Let's go. So, Turtle, ang kukunin ng Happy Beat Emperors in exchange for all of the turrets were taken down by Signal Ultra. Third, third pass Signal Ultra Warriors while Happy Beat Emperors, at least they trade a turtle kill. Actually, yung turtle dito ay napaka-importante para sa isang Gushon. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, we have to take note na siya, isa siya sa mga pinaka-sulit na heroes to actually yeah. take the turtle buff. And I think siya rin yung hero na talagang sobrang dependent sa buff. Oh yeah, I agree. I think there's no other mage like that eh. Yung sobrang dependent sa... Yung kapag wala kang buff, talagang wala kang magawa. Well now, we try to go for the top 
side of the map. Samantala si Arby nakakuha na kanya kang Bloodlust Axe. Eson, nakita dito si Kram. Kaya nila patay ito. And as clear, Kindas activated sprayed by Kram para makalayo dito sa area. And they will take down Eson. Nahuli na kanila and they will be able to close down. Minoan and Minoan Kiro will be available in pretty soon. Kiwa ko pinta nila. Hindi pa hindi na tumama sa upper view with the free hits. At nakakuha na siya yung mega kilaman para doon sa ating kusyon. Stake on the drop. Get sa double. Few after taking down the Granger. Grabe. Atapon pa na si Mr. V. Tama ba yung hook na yun? Parang hindi yata sulit yun. Parang hindi yata maganda yun. Ang ganda ng pasok niya ako doon. Inunahan niya. Bago pa nakarating yung uh, yung pra, yung uh, hook, si, hook ni uh, Franco dito. Pinasok niya muna para siya yung target ng turret. Amazing. They done. Amazing. Jungle who has a signal. Ultra Warriors. So clear na sila na nga ang lumalabang sa ating laban ngayon. Yep. Pero hindi pa tapos na. Ay, para kay MB. Yep. Very Mal early. Malaking problema pa rin yung uh, Granger kasi kapag hindi nila nakuha, nahuli yan, parang Kimi rin, sobrang taas ang damage output. And kapag tinamaan sila nung uh, yung bala ni Granger at tikit-tikit sila, delikado sila kasi yung combination ng uh, Habib Tempest dito, yung Lunox, yung Order of Brilliance, hindi rin joke na tiisin ng Signal Ultra Warriors. Kapag tiniis nila yun, natatala sila sa, sa isang teamfight, may uh, comeback potential pa yung Lyrit Mahabi with Emperor. Tumamay hook ni Mr. V dito. Di, Makakasaan na kanyang Minowal Fury. Hindi pa niya i-commit so far and they will just go to the, to to the top lane as this moment. Tamang box out now lang habang putulak dito mga members ng Signal Ultra Warriors. It's the hook. It's Ooh. not. Get on, Nick. Chop him back. Okay, D. Okay, D. Okay, D. Okay, Chop him back. Yes, on 10. And, syempre, few free. Lead him sa likod. Pula sa likod. Lulok, down for the count. Franco, ang kasunod. Kapapatid lang yung Minotaur. Pero okay lang. Then, may shutdown naman. Pula doon sa Gushon. Yaku! Tinamaan ni Barbiel. At nakakuha na kill. Doon sa ating tabs. Pula doon sa Gushon. Yaku! Tinamaan ni Barbiel. At nakakuha na kill. Doon sa ating tabs. Tumama pa kayo concentrated. Masyari tapos. Yaku. Nakatakas. Wala doon sa barrier. Mid lane turret, mid lane turret. And 2 for 3 ang naging trade off. Kasama pa yung Torre sa top and Torre sa baba. Sa gitna, I mean. And that's the last outer turret para sa Happy Feet Emperors. Yeah, pero even uh, even though ang taas ng lead ng Signal Ultra Wise doon, nakita natin yung damage output ng isang Granger. From Happy Feet Emperors, oh, they're gonna definitely oh, take it. Naging fight, pero nag-miss yung hook. Sprint. Sprint. Mula kay Yaku. Sinayawan ni Yaku and turtle objective for Signal Ultra Wires here. Extending their lead further. 5,000 gold na yung lamang nila dito against Happy Feet Emperors. Oh, interestingly, di, yung kanyang pagkaagamit dito ng Minoan Fury sulit, I think it's one of the, of those players na gusto talaga yung big ticket ultimate. So far, nakakita tayo ng dalawang Minoan Fury and so far, so far, puro four-man Minoan yeah. Fury. Oo, oh, uh, apat lagi. Si design niya rito naka-mystery shop, no? So marami ng uh, yeah. items na nakuha yung uh, Gushin natin. I'm curious kung uh, inuna niya muna yung so Flock of Destiny. Or, no, ay, they, actually go for damage. Yeah. Transition into Genius 1. That's why he was able to burst down the Thams, even the Lunox, so easily. Yep. I think yung Grok din natunaw, eh. Genius 1 is actually really good. Well, the thing with Grok is, it's a very tanky target, pero sa mga laban na nasa gitna siya, hindi siya makunat. It's gonna be Yaku versus Arpe, pero si Yaku actually, mukhang target lang niya yung minions dito, eh. No. Actually, sinasayawan lang niya. Was able to actually outlast the Contra Inferno. It's already over para kay Arpe. Yaku, naku po! What a play, ah! Moment mula kay Yaku! Sinayawan lang yung thumbs natin and Yaku outplaying Arby there. Top 1 oh. global thumbs ka nga pero Yaku main niya ako. That was amazing. And he fought kasi na mayroong mga minions kaya mayroong extra life yeah. skills si Yaku courtesy of the Bloodlust Axe. Rarely ang isang tao ay nakakalas sa isang Thamos 1v1 sa Continent Inferno but Yaku understanding the hero very well. Was able to win against Arbe. Oh, hook from Mr. B once again missing and Signal Ultra Wars. Meron silang window dito. Oh! Against Happy Feet Emperor's Munti. Kaya pinatikim lang ni Disanya. Oh. Sabi niya, guys, ganito ako kakate. Ang kate. And that's if you actually hitting with the concentrated energy. Isang oh, ano lang yun. Maximum ha? energy, mate. Isang Shadow Blade Slaughter lang yun. Wala pang incandescent. Ayan, pinatikim. Pinatikim si Mr. Yeah. B. Ang oh, sakit. Ang kate. Ang kate. At dahil dyan, kailangan natin ng boss. Sabi na, ang kate ba siya? Kate, kate tagal lang. Kamat lang ako, kuya, ano, kuya Wolf, kuya Midnight. Ang kate. Oh, so, I have to take note na yung Signal Ultra Warriors, yung adjustment nila for game number two, it's not much about the heroes, not much about the... And now, Gushon is actually having a lot of farm. Yeah. Hindi siya na mamablema ngayon. Napakalakas yung kate. Nakita niyo naman si Disanya. Sobrang kate. Now, 
depensa mula sa RV Neighbors mo ang hindi mangyayari dahil nandito si B at si Q nang mabox out lang Eson and Desanya more than enough to take down the Lord for the Breast of Signal Ultra Warriors nakita dito ni Mr. V nila sila you know you know nako po mga patawin siya ako yes there's gonna be the shutdown but Eson with the ultimate now D with the overview rito oh no sa naman naman hindi po hindi less than 4 and now damage from Desanya more than enough take down taking down the Ranger RB and Mr. V tatakbuan na mga members ng Signal Ultra pero ako sa kabar hindi Desanya wala Wala kang takas, RP. You're the last one remaining. May, may Pero mukhang hindi likod. magtatagal. May bouncer sa likod, Kuya Bull. May bouncer nga naman. Bawal ka umuwi. Napapaligiran ka na namin. Subuko ka na. Sabi ng Signal Ultra Warriors. Wipeout versus Happy Feet Emerers as they're now eyeing to take this game. Mukhang re-rectahin nila yata ito, Kuya Midnight. Oh my God, D. Hindi nga pwedeng less than 4. Hindi pwedeng less than 4. Yung ultimate niya rito, hindi niya, na, hindi niya mapindot hanggat hindi apat yung target Bawal. niya. Bawal, Bawal pindutin. pindutin. Grabe. Anong klaseng cellphone meron ka? Iba talaga. Iba talaga pag kinalampag na ni Kuya D. Ay, nako, grabe. Feeling ko si D dito, professional man, tatabog eh. Grabe. Iba pala magtabog si Kuya D. Oo, hindi mo yung less than 4. Than 4. Nakita mo yung ginagawa ni D kanina. Sabi niya, subukan yung lumapit sa akin. Subukan yung otapindot pag-apat. Opo. Yung minawang siyuri niya. Hindi ko wakat HFE. Nako po, yako. Alam na alam niya yan. Kamisato niya yan. Gets the kill on the Lunox. Sabay talo. Dito sa may patang likuran. Courage Mask activated. Oh, si Desanya. Desanya. Pinatay niya yung Franco na nagkakabul sa kanya. On the bot side of the map. Yako, nakita na naman si RB. At alam mo, wala nang minowan kasi tatlo na lang sila dito. Oo, hindi pwede. Hindi niya mapindot. Hindi niya mapindot. Ayun, di saan niya? Going in! Nako po, hindi siya dito. Masyado maasim. Masim. Masim nation. Oo, sabi niya, ML na ML ako eh. Pinatay niya kasi yung Franco na nagkakabul sa kanya. Sabi niya, di saan niya ako eh. Kaso, problema, yung kakampi niya nag-objectives. Okay, okay. Now, it's gonna be the Lord Nick who will get it. It's gonna be few. And now, Graham is gonna be taken down. And... sa Signal Ultra Warriors. Sabi, po, sabi ni ano, sabi ni Dirito, sorry guys, di ko mapindot yung Minoan Fury, di apat eh. <laughs> Pero actually, uh, inactivate niya yung Minoan Fury on that Lord, I yeah. think, but which is understandable. Para lang masecure. Para lang masecure. Pero, so far, 3 out of 4 na Minoan Fury na ginamit ni apat ang tinatamaan. Yep. And, hindi niya natin kung maukulit ko yun for Signal Ultra Warriors. Ito na naman, si Kuya D, nasa bandang unahan, hinaharap niya yung Happy Feet Emperors dito, nakakakita siya ng apat. Sabi niya, Desanya! May Maganda nakikita na. akong apat! Maganda ka na! <laughs> Ready mo na yung mga Shadow Blade Slaughter mo! May Ay, nakikita akong apat! Hindi pwedeng less than four. Sabi ni Kuya D. Oo, kung nagmamat kayo, <laughs> si Kuya D rito. Minuman Fury is equal to hindi pwedeng less than four. Oh. If, 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 if equal to para four. Ka para ka nagko-code, para ka nagko-code. If equal to four, Minuman Fury. If not, else, else, else pala, else. Else, back. <laughs> else, back. Get back. <laughs> oh, Mr. Pirito, wag mong i-hook yan. Ingat, Apat ingat yung ka. katabi mo. Po. Ingat, ingat ka doon. Oo, oh, naka-charge, naka-charge. Naka, Punong-puno yung uh, Fury Stack na dito. Galit na galit na daw. Pag kayo, yung yung na ako po, na. na naman kayo dyan. O, oh, lima kayo dyan, Sabi lima kayo dyan. Oh, Yaku, actually, na-surpress. Nauli ni Mr. V dito. Pag meron pang talon, ako po, may ikot ang Hurricane Tons na manon. At yun na naman. Ah, Apat na, na, na naman! Hindi talaga pwedeng less than four kay Kuya D. Signal Ultra Warriors gets game number two. Kuya D! Kuya D, hindi pwedeng less than 4. Yun ang nagpanalo sa Signal Ultra Warriors. Nakita mo kanina, di ba? Sabi nila, panalo na kami. Pero sabi ni D, ayoko yung Minoman Fury. Hindi apat eh. <laughs> hindi apat, kailangan talaga apat. Grabe pala magdabog si Kuya D. Oo, pag kinalampag, pag kinalampag na ni Kuya D, yari na kayo lahat. <laughs> Alam mo yung ano, parang kunwari magkatropa. Nagdabog siya.